the QClick audience response system from Como Height Vision allows you to have fun in the class while at the same time have the ability to test and record the student's test results. After inserting the receiver into the USB port on your computer, simply double click on the QClick icon on your desktop. The software automatically opens to the correct software and you simply enter your username and password. Once that's done, you can see from our toolbar that we're connected and all of the functionality and the controls for our QClick are now on one toolbar at our fingertips. The first thing we're going to do is to set up our class. All QClick systems allow up to 400 students to participate in the class at one time. I can, if I so choose, manually set up a class by giving it a name and adding students. I can select from a pre-made class and at the same time I can add and remove students from that class and I can also import a class roster from an Excel spreadsheet. I can do the same with my subject and with the teacher. Once we've selected the class the subject and the teacher, we select OK and we move on to loading our test. The QClick audience response system can take any bulleted PowerPoint slide show you've created and automatically convert that into a test. First, we'll find our unconverted PowerPoint Now we'll go to our exam editor. Once I click on the exam editor tab, I simply come over to the setup and now it will take me into the setup. It has automatically acquired all of the PowerPoint slides in my presentation and now I just have to select the correct answers for each of the questions. The QClick automatically keeps track of the question number and I simply have to hit next. If I've made a mistake or want to check my work, I can go back to the previous questions as well. I can also select the time limit for the test. If I want to do it for one slide, I can do that, but if I choose to have it modified for all of the questions in the test, I can do that as well. I can also select a difficulty level and once I'm done and I click the save setting we'll see all of the slides in the left hand side converted from bullets to A, B, C, D. Now I simply exit the exam editor, move to the quiz genius and I'm ready to give the test. Taking the teacher's remote control, I find the icon for the start exam on my teacher's remote control, press it, and now I'm ready to give the test. We can see the student members of the test. I have three students in my class, there's the response. And when I start the test, up in the upper right hand corner, we'll see the timer start to count down. We can see all the students have answered the question and they've answered it within the 10 second time limit. I can, if I so choose, see how my students did on any question in the test. I can simply come up, look at the report, it shows the student's name, if they were in a group, what their mark was, the time of the response, and the total points. I can also call up a histogram to look at the percentages of the class in terms of right, wrong, and in some cases not answered. 
Since my remote control is also a PowerPoint remote control, I can move on into any of the questions I want to continue with, and if I choose to only ask a couple of questions, I can do that as well. Students can also change their answer, and you'll see the color change, and as long as they do it before the time expires, it will be recorded. Again, I can take a look at the results and call up the histogram if I so choose. If I choose to do none of these, that's fine as well. When the test is over, I simply go to the same icon that I started the test with and hit it again. I'm going to exit the activity and I'm going to save the results. Now we can go to our reporting function. We click on the reports tab and the reports icon and as you can see I can query by the activity or the class or the subject. I get a sneak preview of the class class that was in there for the test and I can look at the different types of results I would like to do and merely by double clicking on those result responses I can see full screen what my students have done in that test. I can also save these files by hitting the generate function and I can export my files as an Excel spreadsheet. The QClick audience response system from Como Height Vision allows many different opportunities of testing and gaming activity, which we'll be showing you in subsequent videos.